Kim Rowe here at Box of Bands, and I'm here with Paddy McCory after his uh, fifth round stoppage in the Fela. How are you feeling, Paddy? Feel amazing. Uh, it's freaking daily. Like, like you seen it out there, it was, it was, like, it was a ladder. Like, I can only imagine being Michael Conlon in front of 8,000 people. It's insane. Proper into the fight. How are you, how are you feeling uh, coming into the fight? Because obviously, you had a good reputation as a very tough, durable opponent. Yeah, listen, today I was doubting myself so much just because I knew like, what Sergey brings. I think you look at his record. And it's 11 2 and 2, but it's very deceiving. Um, he, he he's competed at a, at a serious level, and he's done 10 rounds about about, about eight or nine times. Um, so, like doubts doubts started creeping in, but um, but once I got here and I seen the stadium, I was like like I'm meant to be here. You're from this area as well. You're really close to this to, to here. Do, do you think that's what made you kind of put more pressure on yourself? Yeah, probably. Like like I knew like everybody's coming here. Probably expecting me to win, um, but I knew that it was a serious, a serious fight um, and a massive risk. Um, so yeah, that pressure adds to it, and you never want to really get beaten in front of everybody, do you? But uh, yeah, no, I like, I'm so happy now. Like. You hurt him really bad to the nose. Uh, obviously broke his nose. I think it was the fourth round. Did, did you know kind of at that stage? And when once you did that, it was kind of you were going to close the curtains on him. Once I seen his reaction, I kind of knew that he was in like like massive distress. I seen it just split open straight away, um, and he looked at the ref. Uh, I didn't want to, I didn't want to go all out, but uh, because, as I say, he's fought ten rounds loads of times, and he's super fit, and he punches hard. So, and like I just thought, let's break his heart, let's keep jobbing him, let's keep jobbing him, and break his heart. And then he started getting like really eager, and he started walking on the more shots. That was it. You brought you up in the rankings now. After that, now, what are you looking to do now in your next step? Listen, I always say, I hope my next fight's the right fight. Um, and that's going to be up to like my team. So I like I'm willing if they think it's the right fight for me. I'm willing to take it. Yeah. Is there any particular a belt anything at all? No, well like that's the silver. Like I think the I think the international is it's vacant. So yeah. just an upgrade. Why not? Yeah. Well, congr- congratulations, party, and thanks oh, very hey. much for talking to me. Right? Thank you very much. Thank you.